Hello guys, the DB Grinder here, back at it again with another video, and this time we have Pier555 with 781 rating versus Nesh with 752 rating, so it's going to be another high rated DB video, and let's hop right in. We're going to see a tie, and then we're going to see Pier when the rock, paper, scissors shoot, so they get to decide if they want to go first or second. And we see 40 versus 40, gotta love to see it, and Pier's going to go first. Opening hand is Hanger, Ash, Gold Gadget, Prosperity, and Nib. So this is solid. This this is like exactly what you want to see. And then they have Talons, Phantasmic, Quick Launch, Black Dragon, Red MD. So no hand traps. Does have like a Phantasmic to try to draw into some. They also have Ash Blossom that could stop that. Gonna go Hanger. And then Hanger's going to go search for B-Buster Drake. And then Prosperity. Banish 3. Looking at the Banish. We see like a Gear Giant X. This card's cool. And then Mill. Going to take Called By out of those options. And then put those back. Normal Summon Gold effect. Bring out B. And then Hanger effect. Equip Driver from deck. And then driver effect, equip C, and then effect the C to unequip. So I'm fairly certain that they prosperityed before comboing to try to play around Lancia. Which I do the same thing in like Invoke Dogmatica. I mean it makes sense. You don't want to play in the Lancia more than you already have to. Go in the IP and then Phantasmi is going to try being dropped. B1, Phantasmi 2. And then chain link three ash blossom go search a and then link those off for a unicorn c effect bring out a and then link those off for appalooza and then banish abc bring out abc buster pass turn draw world legacy guard dragon so the end board's not bad and i mean it's not like good it's definitely not good but an appalooza abc it's solid this card tagging out into these is just, it's so insane. It's so insane. Draw World Legacy Guard Dragon and then Quick Launch. Bring out Rocket Synchron from deck. Link off for Striker Dragon and then Striker Dragon Effect. Appalooza Negate. World Legacy Guard Dragon. Bring out Rocket Synchron. And then go in the LP. Effect the move LP. And then go Talons to take. Gonna chain ABC Buster to hit LP. And then chain effect to tag out. Bring out ABC. And then take Appalooza. And then Hanger. That's gonna equip B to C. Banish Striker for Red MD. Red MD effect. Bring out Rocket Synchron. So this isn't looking too good for Peer. And then go for Romulus, Romulus effect, that's going to go search out Ravine. And then activate Ravine, Ravine effect, get rid of Phantasmace, and Abs, Abs effect, go grab Tracer. And then normal summon Tracer, pop Ravine, bring out Recharger. And then link those, or Synchro into a Chaos Ruler, Chaos Ruler effect, mill 5. That is nice. Wow, that's light engrave, chamber, tidying, chaos space, incredible. I'm gonna go grab the nib from the grave, and then banish white for black, chaos space, put back white, and then draw in the chaos space, link off for striker dragon, and then black to go search white, and then banish black for white, link that off. For a Pisty, and then Pisty effect, bringing out Rocket Synchron, turn those into a Hot Red, Striker Dragon, pop Pisty, add Recharger, and then Recharger, bringing out Tracer, Tiding for Chamber, Chamber effect to go search Tiding, and then get rid of those for a Savage, Savage effect, equip Pisty, and then Chaos Space, get rid of Nib. Go search out Levy and Ear. And then banish lights and darks for Levy and Ear. And then you're going to get Levy, chain link 2 red on Buster Drake. 
the spell and trap, obviously. And then that's going to pop those, and you're going to get B and A effect. That's going to add back C, and then go search A. And then link those off for a sword. Chaos Ruler bring itself out. Like, that was a really, really good game one. Like, being OTK'd through, like, Nib, Appalooza, ABC Buster, it's nice. Game one was, like, 16 minutes long. Now, going on to game two, we're going to see ABC go first. Opening hand is set rotation, Ash, terraforming, hangar A. A lot of field spells. 60% of the hand. And then they have Talons, Phantasmi. Crazy, because Talons and Phantasmi were in the same spot last time. And then Chaos Space, Nocto, and White. So again, like the hand could potentially have... Hand traps. And I think Ash was even in the same spot as last time. Weird. Terraforming, gonna go search Hanger. Then activate Hanger, go search B Buster. And then normal summon out B, Hanger effect, that's gonna equip Driver. And then Driver effect, equip C. And then C to unequip, link those off into an IP. And then Phantasme, well, these are going to trigger first, then Phantasme. Going to get Chain 1C, Chain 2B, Chain 3 Phantasme, lets it go through, draws Phantasme Quick Launch, and then puts back Phantasme. Is that the best to just get rid of Phantasme there? Or do you hold it so that way you can drop it again on your turn? The play used to be really common during Striker Orcus format. And then C will end up summoning C from hand, turn those into unicorns, so obviously then they come up here because they're just link climbing. And then go on the Appalooza, and then A, add back C. And then banish ABC, bring out ABC Buster, set set rotation. So, looks like I was just wrong. You know, I don't know this deck's combos enough new format, but I was definitely wrong there. And then end phase, ABC Buster, Banish Phantasme, pass turn, draw Phantasme, unfortunate. And then quick launch, bring out Tracer from deck, link that off for Striker Dragon, and then Striker Nocto. It's gonna go search boot. And then negating Nocto. Talons to take and then chain ABC Buster, banish Appalooza, chain ABC Buster, bring out ABC. That, I mean, that works. Even gonna have like Ash Blossom as an interruption, set rotation as an interruption, equipping A to B. And then Chaos Space, get rid of white, and then Chain Ash to negate that. Tribute for Nocto, and then activate Boot. Boot effect to summon back from Grave. Chain Set Rotation, that's going to give them Silent Universe, and then I'm assuming it's Hanger that they're giving themselves. Yup. And then they admit defeat the there, and they see the Hanger. I mean, they know that they're going to lose next turn. So now, going on to game three, we're going to see dragons go first. Opening hands is A, Lancia, Hanger, Unauthorized, and Prosperity. So, they have one going second card, and then they have Talons, World Legacy Guard, Dragon, Lancia, Tiding, Red MD. Wow. Bricked. God, I hate to see it. I've been seeing dragons bricking a lot. I just, I think they're just unfortunate. I don't think it's the deck. It just, it happens. Like, no matter what deck you play, like, most decks can brick. It happens. It sucks when it happens. Draw Lancia. And then Hanger. That's gonna go search B Buster Drake. And then Normal Summon B, Hanger Effect, Equip Driver. And then Drop Lancia. Poke for 15. So chose to not Prosperity, trying to play around Lancia there. 
And then main phase two, set unauthorized, pass, draw safe food. And then normal safe food, use the effect. Gonna go search black dragon from deck. And then drop Lancia, talents to draw, draw talents, levy. Wow. Just wow. And then I'm going to go World Legacy Guard Dragon, bring out Saferd from the grave, Battle Phase, Attack over B, and then Driver's going to get destroyed, Main Phase 2, Pass, draw Nib, and then Normal Summon A, Hanger Effect to equip, it's going to equip C. And then Tiding, bounce back Saferd and B, and then Chain Unauthorized, that's going to equip C to B, so now it's unaffected by Traps. Holy, like linking off two monsters there looks insane. But link off for gadget, and then you're gonna get B and A, B, A. <laughs> and then banish ABC, bring out ABC Buster, gadget effect, special summon out A, and then battle phase poke, and this is exactly game. That was, besides game three, that was a good match. Game three was unfortunate, but it, it happens. I was playing uh, a different build of Dragon Link yesterday, and I opened up like Black Dragon, White Dragon, Boot, Abs. Like it was just like, I was just looking at my hand and I was like, there's just no way. I was like, there's no way I brick this hard. And then my opponent was like, Red Eyes, Fusion, Dragoons, Set, Summon Limit, Pass. And I was like, oh yeah, oh yeah, that, that's game, that's game. But, I don't know, Dragon Links are cool. They're definitely the best deck, in my opinion. It'll be cool to see how this deck, uh, like, keeps adapting and, like, moving forward. We've already seen, like, Tiding move to three. Like, it's small changes, but, like, they could be, like, good changes, you know, like, Virtual World. Like, their end board was still VFD, but they were adding, like, Chow Fang, Fortune Tune to the extra deck. Just making the deck, like, a little bit better here and there. But looking at the match, the match was about 32 and a half minutes long. Definitely not bad. But that's going to be it for the video. I'm going to guess that the video is... I'm going to go 16 minutes, 17 seconds. And with that being said, the DB Grinder signing off. Peace. Have a nice day.